Okay, so my name is Amir. I'm a doctor of chemical engineering. And since 1998, I've been the uh, scientific director of a center devoted to the study of uh, plants which grow midway between uh, the Dead Sea and the hills on top of it. And the reason uh, we are a group of researchers studying these plants is that uh, they cope with intense climatic stress. You have on one end the Dead Sea, which is the lowest place on Earth, and on the other end, just 16 uh, miles or so uh, westwards, westwards from uh, the Dead Sea, you have hills, high altitude hills, which uh, uh, have plants growing, sometimes under s uh, snow conditions or intense uh, cold in winter whereas the Dead Sea is always very uh, hot and dry. So you get two populations meeting and they experience intense climatic stress by this transition. And we find that by coping to such plants, they some, to such stress, they sometimes produce plant substances which control plant growth. And it, it appears that these substances may help the body sometimes to get out of inflammation conditions, such as for treating uh, eczema, uh, psoriasis, uh, asthma, diabetes, which is also an inf uh, inflammatory disease, arthritis. And so we've been focusing on applying such plants to replace uh, cortisone, which uh, in many cases can have uh, serious side effects. And mostly cortisone and co cortisone derivatives are being given for people with various uh, skin uh, inflammation conditions and asthma and so forth. Also, when you have the uh, extremity of a uh, climatic zone, you sometimes obtain uh, plants which are unique, endemic species. And we apply such plants uh, in many cases to, uh, to ends which are, are also original. For instance, we have plants rich in aromas, which can help us treat uh, uh, various um, infectious problems, such as uh, nail fungus. So the idea of uh, CADAM has been to uh, provide people all over the world with alternatives for dangerous antibiotics, um, um, cortisone, and so forth to, um, to use traditional herbs of uh, biblical times in modern applications and to cultivate rare plants, sometimes endangered species of this unique region near the Dead Sea and to, um, to uh, apply, apply all these extracts in totally natural formulations. We avoid any synthetic substances. We do it uh, meticulously because we do not want to uh, um, impair the natural uh, substances, which are very, very rich and diverse in many of these uh, extracts. And we've uh, been uh, fortunate to obtain also assistance from the uh, Israeli Ministry of Science, which uh, um, allowed us to create an, an original research center devoted to the study of these plants. And I've been the scientific director, director of this center since uh, 1998 until 2012.